please rise for a brief moment of silence followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, New Brighton High School. Today is Friday, November 6th, 2020. Uh, just a few notes before I get into this morning's announcements. As you know, we've been back to virtual uh, this week. Uh, we had some uh, cases uh, with some teachers in the high school, uh, which has forced us to close the building to students and has led us back on the virtual path uh, rather than our hybrid model. And with that, uh, just some changes that you know have been in place, but you guys need to be aware of uh, the schedule that we were following uh, when we were hybrid. So, you know, start of school at 7:30 on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. That's going to continue um, in the virtual setting. Uh, so, you know, your attendance will be open from 7:15 to 7:45. Uh, that was something you were doing in your home room or your first period class when you were in the building. Uh, now that we're virtual, that the home room will still be there in your Schoology. Uh, there are you know, two answers to the question. Make sure you're answering the question right, hitting submit. And again, that is open from 7.15 to 7.45, um, just like we were under the hybrid model when we were coming into the building. Uh, and hopefully we'll be back in the building here soon. Uh, but in the time being, uh, under the virtual model, let's make sure uh, we're checking into homeroom between 7.15 and 7.45, answering the question properly um, and you know, submitting that so you're getting credit for being in school. Uh, some announcements in general. Uh, AP registration forms and test fees are due in the counseling department by Friday, today, November 6th. If you need another form, please stop in the counseling department, which you can't do that right now because we're not in the building. So email Ms. Hubbard or call Ms. Hubbard. Um, or Ms. Gentile in the guidance department. Or you can email me um, and ask a question about AP. Uh, your AP teachers, uh, Mr. Lamb, Ms. Zern, um, Mr. Pasquo, and Ms. Dado, and um, whoever else I'm missing in AP teachers, uh, they can answer your questions as well. Uh, AP Chem, Mr. Stuber, AP Kalk, Mr. Lamb, uh, AP Euro, Mr. Pasquo, AP Lit, with Ms. Dado. Uh, if you get in touch with those teachers, they can answer the questions about AP registration. Uh, parking permits, you know, when we're back into the building, uh, if you have your, your license and you want to drive to school any days of the week, you have to stop in the counseling department at their $5. There's a form you need to fill out, which includes your signature, your parent's signature, your driver's license number, your license plate number, and again, they're five dollars, and you can get those uh, from Ms. Gentile in the guidance department. Uh, our CTC students, you also can drive to and from the CTC. Uh, you will need the previously mentioned New Brighton parking permit, but there's also a form, especially for our CTC students who want to drive, um, and also if they want to take passengers with them. Uh, there's a back side of the form that needs filled out as well. And again, those forms are available with the counseling department uh, with Ms. Gentile. Roslyn's is still looking to hire uh, someone to work a few hours after school and on Saturday mornings. Uh, it would be approximately three days a week. You'll be responsible for carrying stock, sweeping, and taking out the garbage. If you're interested, you can apply in person and talk to them down at Roslyn's Candy Castle downtown. Uh, in sports, congratulations to our volleyball players, two seniors, Stephanie Houck, who was awarded first team all-conference, and Miss Bethany Crutt was second team for the 2020 volleyball section all-star teams uh, voted on by their coaches. Uh, happy birthday today to Michael Goolish. Uh, lunch, which you would be picking up uh, at the back of the building, would be peanut butter and jelly, or Rich's Pizza, mixed vegetables and mandarin oranges. Now, weather. 
Today, November 6, 2020, our weather will be a high of 65, a low of 44. Uh, it'll be cloudy with a 50% chance of rain. Uh, this weekend's weather looks to be improving. Uh, Saturday will be in the upper 60s, and Sunday will hit 70, uh, about almost 71 degrees on Sunday. So enjoy the weekend. Have a great one. Thank you. Now that we have the weather for Friday and the rest of the weekend, uh, I know the teachers will be turning in grades uh, Sunday evening by midnight, and that brings me to another topic that I want to bring up uh, with all of our high school students, grades 9 through 12. Uh, obviously, this has been a different start to the school year, uh, different than any other uh, in, in the history of school for the most part. Um, one thing that we have seen is some students uh, who have been live in their classes, checking their email, uh, into their Schoology on a daily basis and attending the live sessions that we have offered. Uh, those students are doing extremely well. Uh, they're getting the support that they need. They're communicating with their teachers. Um, they're they're you know, following up with good questions and their teachers are able to interact with them you know, on a daily basis, live and in person, uh, even though it's on the other side of a computer screen. But those students that are doing that um, are doing well and their grades are a reflection of that. Um, there are a number of our students though that are struggling and you know the ones that are truly struggling are, are the ones that are not taking advantage of being in the live courses, um, not asking questions, they're not live so they're either watching the recordings um, or they're just trying to do it on their own. And, and as you know, you know school's hard enough uh, whether it's in person or behind a computer screen or on the other side of a uh, camera. but. You know, taking advantage and being on, online um, virtually live uh, with the teachers is the, the best way uh, to be successful. And you know, again, the students that are doing that, we thank you. Um, you know, we're proud of you. Uh, the ones that are struggling, that's the main reason why you are struggling. And uh, we can't stress it enough that you know, we offer live instruction from 7.30 to 1.30, uh, four days a week. and you know, in order to be successful, that's your best bet uh, for turning your grades around, showing improvement, um, and Im improving your, your standing uh, in the building. So, uh, you know, I know many of you are on Snapchat, and, and I know people talk about streaks. I'm not on Snapchat. I don't have any streaks. Um, but one streak that I think we need to, to focus on rather than Snapchat is, you know, getting a streak on Schoology and being live in your classes. Uh, let's start that streak in the second nine weeks. Uh, grades will be due here at the end of the weekend. Um, report cards will be going out um, soon thereafter, uh, I believe November 12th. Um, and, and a lot of people right now are in jeopardy of, of not doing so well and not getting a great report card. So uh, that's why we're here. We're here for education. Uh, we're able to support every student. Um, live instruction, 7.30 to 1.30, four days a week, office hours, 1.30 to 3 o'clock, uh, almost every day. Um, if you miss something, get in those office hours, talk to your teachers, email them, check your email every day. Um, you're getting announcements, you're getting the information from teachers, um, links for live classes, links for uh, office hours. Uh, again, that's how you're gonna be successful in the virtual setting um, until we can you know, get all back together in the building at one time, um, or at least back to our hybrid model here in the very near future. So we miss you guys. We love you. Um, you know, again, work hard this weekend. Get it, all the grades in you possibly can to, to boost your, your grades in all of your classes. Ask questions. Email your teachers. Log into Schoology. Check your attendance. Uh, we are MB. Have a great weekend. Uh, November's here, and sooner or later we'll know who our president is. Uh, hopefully by the time you see this, we'll know who our 46th president of the United States is. We are MB. We miss you. We love you. Have a great weekend. Thank you.